All right, I am going to take you guys into our new house well for the weekend uh, let me go ahead and show you guys this airbnb that mark and i are staying at it is a house that's what we rented this time because we wanted a full kitchen we have no intention of going out we're just getting a lot of planning done and all of that so let me go ahead and take you guys inside and show you guys what this house has to offer and i will link the little airbnb link in the description box just in case you guys are coming to san antonio you have a larger family or need more room uh, this one is pretty big or at least it has a lot of bedrooms so let me go ahead and open the door and take you guys inside all right, we are walking in. So this one's definitely more on the modern side. We've got these two lights. The same light is actually on the front porch as well. So nice walkway into the main living areas of the house. If we turn to the right, obviously with the glass doors, this is meant to be an office, but they did turn it into a bedroom, just in case you needed the extra a sleeping room and all the bedrooms believe there's four total have king size beds so perfect if you have multiple children or if you're like coming and you have a couple different families the adults can have their own bedrooms and then all the kids can hang out together there's also plenty of room for like extra um, sleeping bags and stuff like that if you wanted all the kids to be together so this is just one bedroom no closet anything like that again king size bed then if we keep walking this way, we've got the hall closet here where they have, this is actually all the pillows and stuff are outside, actually. I'll show you guys outside in a little bit, but that all goes, all the cushions and stuff for everything outside. Okay, I've got my purse sitting here, but here's the kitchen. Again, very modern, which is really cool. A little dining table over there. Mark and I actually brought all of our food as well. So we're gonna be utilizing this kitchen and cooking. The refrigerator's really cool. They've got all the, oh, this fridge doesn't like me. There we go. <laughs> I just tapped and knocked and, but that's one reason why I picked this house. I wanted to play around with all like the fancy appliances and stuff like that. So that fridge is pretty cool. It's got a pretty interesting water thing too on there it's got like smart grid wi-fi and all of that a little bar over here with a wine fridge we did bring some wine and stuff we've got a bosch microwave a very cool can't get into the pantry they have that locked gas oven which is what i have so that's going to be awesome to continue cooking with i have our nice coffee in the morning oh, okay now that i'm closer i can see that this table matches the thing that they have in the entryway also. Okay, then coming over here, so Mark and I are getting away. We're actually not that far from our house, a little closer than we <laughs> originally thought, but I loved this. Um, I wanted to try this out as well because this is what I have in mind if there's the room to put upstairs in the game room. And then Mark and I are doing a lot of planning this weekend. So this is gonna be nice just to relax, lay back, spread out, have like, you know, our laptops and papers everywhere and not feel like we're sitting upright in a chair all the time. We can kind of go back and forth. So this is gonna be cool. And also I wanted to try it out for the possibility for the game room. I think it said this TV is like 80 inches, definitely bigger than ours. It is a massive. Okay, and then it does have a fireplace, a gas fireplace. And if we come this way, there are the rest of the bedrooms. So in this bedroom, it is a master bedroom. I've never slept on a bed that low to the floor before, so I'm not quite sure what room we're gonna be staying in, but that's very interesting. And like I said, it's modern. Oh my gosh, that's an 80 inch TV, 80 inch TV as well with the glass dresser. And then if we come in here, you'll have to read the description of this place, but they, not super recently, because I can definitely tell it's been loved on, um, but they did lots of renovations to the bathrooms in this house. So this one is another one I wanted to try out. Um, it's got like all the jets, left wall, right head, right wall, and then it has the ceiling or shower, overhead shower as well. So I'm excited to take a shower in here tomorrow. It's got two sinks because this is the master right there and then the towels and then this hello this mirror is on let me show you you can change it 
So there's the blue light, and then we've got the white light, and then a oh, white and blue, and off. That's pretty cool. They do have speakers everywhere if you were really into listening to music. All right, so let's go out of the master and down the hallway. This is kind of cool with the ambient lighting on it. This is where all the like electronic stuff is. Look at that. So if you wanted to listen to music and everything, I'm not quite sure. I don't know anything about any of that. So there we go. All right. Over here to the left is a bedroom, again, with a king size bed. And yeah, is that, that's a big TV. <laughs> that's a really big TV. So you've got there. Um, and then we'll go to this, these bedrooms first. Well, this one's, this is the laundry room. And I think I have to step in. Yeah, I have to step in to turn the light on. So we've got the laundry room right here if we needed to do a little laundry. And then here's the last bedroom over here again king size bed and big tv okay and then the second bathroom so there's the master bathroom and then there's this bathroom it's right here oh the fan came on right away so this is a tub shower i like how high they put that shower head that's not something you see all the time. Sometimes when you're like, you know, really at the beach, things like that, the shower heads are pretty low. And this has the same, that's pretty cool. All right, hopefully that fan wasn't too loud. It should turn off in a minute. All right, so that's the house. There's Mark, say hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm excited about this. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Um, this does come out though, like this is an ottoman. So it's the couch with the ottoman that you can put it together. I think this would be cool up in the game room. I just don't know if it's too big or not. It would take up a lot of space. Okay, let me take you outside because there's something questionable out here, but it, it, I mean, it seemed pretty cool. Let me I unlock it. Okay. Yep, there it is. All right. And the sun is just now going down, so it's a little, a little bright in my eyes. So we could grill if we wanted to. You guys hear that over there? We'll get over there in a minute. So I don't think I'm missing anything. Let me go over here and just make sure that, obviously it's the winter time, so a lot of the plants and, and floral flowers are not the best. Okay, so this is, wow, really loud, but it's called the Pleasure Pit. It even has a sign right there. It's got steps going down to it. I don't know. But here's the hot tub that we can use if we want. It's extra if you want the Pleasure Pit. This is cute though. You can sit over here with the light. There's a TV here. And then, there's an outdoor shower somewhere. Well, this just goes here. I'll have to find the outdoor shower. Uh, over here. Oh, is it? Oh, it's behind this thing. <clears throat> yeah. I see the pieces for it. So interesting. All right, so there is our new home tour. Just kidding, it's, I mean, like sort of, but Airbnb a tour for Mark and I. Uh, again, we're just hanging out here. This is in San Antonio, Texas, not far actually from our house. We were thinking it was gonna be closer to downtown, but you don't get the address until uh, closer to when you book and all of that, so. That's just when, one downfall, I guess. I have to be a little better about that. But Mark and I love staying at Airbnbs. We're actually, it's on our agenda to do, um, who knows when, but to buy a place and turn it into an Airbnb. It's actually pretty popular doing that right now. A lot of people that I follow have been doing it as well. And Mark and I have been thinking about it for a couple of years. So we've been trying to stay at different ones, checking them out. I hope you guys enjoy this house tour. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you guys like me to share whenever we stay at Airbnbs, just let me know and I will continue doing so. Or if you're like, I only wanna see like, 
your normal content or whatever, um, let me know that as well. I enjoy the feedback. Let's me know what to share uh, going forward. So with that, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And if you're not following me on Instagram, I definitely encourage you to do so. I share a lot of behind the scenes, a lot more of my daily life over there. So other than that, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.